Hi guys, it's Gabby and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to do a monthly plan with me. I asked on our Facebook group um, which video you guys would like to see next and I did a bit of a poll and a Marchly, Marchly? <laughs> a monthly plan with me was the most popular. So I thought I'd go ahead and do that. I thought I'd do March because obviously we are halfway through February already and I already have a few plans set out for March so I thought we could just go ahead and um, get March done and then what I might do is do a rewind February spread um, if you guys would like to see it. So I've got this gorgeous kit here from Simply Watercolor Co and of course it's gold foil and this is the first time I've used a monthly kit from her so you get the top headers here with the March in the gold foil and these gorgeous flowers as well foiled I'm sure if you'll be able to see that heaps of icons flags your date dots then you've got your sidebar stickers your bill dues and paydays and just some labels then you have your washi strips, some half boxes, some deco, and then just some headers for the sidebar stickers. So I think that's a really nice kit. Um, yeah, and I think it'll look gorgeous. So I thought we'd just get straight into it. So I'm gonna start with the headers. I'm gonna pop those down and I'll be right back. Okay, that's down and I think it's looking really nice and she doesn't have 2017 written on here which means that you could use it really next year or whenever so that's kind of a good thing. Um, she doesn't have any extra um, full boxes to cover like the days that aren't in the month but I don't really care so I can always just maybe use a washi strip or something across there but and I can always mark events now that are actually on um, this week. So I think I'm going to go ahead and work on my sidebar and I think I'll use this month remember the goals one would be nice um, maybe tasks as well that might be a good one so I'm just going to go ahead and pop all of those down there Okay, so the sidebar is all down. I'm just thinking what I need to do next. I wonder if I'll just go ahead and pop down all of the date dots next just to get that out of the way um, because I don't have any full boxes to put down. So I might do that and I'll do that off camera. So once I've done that, I will be back. Okay, now all the date dots are down. I think I'm just gonna go through now and um, pop things down that are going on in the month. So the first thing I might do is go ahead and pop all the paydays down, which are always on Tuesday. You'll notice that the um, this kit doesn't come with the days. So if you wanted, I know a lot of people like to start their week on a Monday. You could always shift these date dots over and then start it on a Monday. But because I'm used to this being a Sunday now, I'm just going to keep it like that. So paydays are always on Tuesdays. So I'm just going to alternate the colors and pop them down. Okay, so that's paydays down and I'm actually going to use the um, the February dates as well because then I can, can see what's happening this whole week. So on February the 26th, um, we have a birthday party for um, Pavel's nephew. So I'll pop that down on a label, I think, and I'll grab this colour. And then does she have a birthday? icon what I might do is grab one I've got this birthday icon here this gold foil one from planning world so I'm going to use that instead and just pop it here and then that night we've got dinner at my mum and dad's with some friends so I'll get another label I think for that one because they're two quite big events that are happening that day and I'm just going to put it down the bottom here 
and then I might get the clinking glasses icon for that one like that then on the 28th I just have to remember to change my contact lenses so I have this sheet from um, Fox and Cactus and I might use they're all quite bright colors but I'm wondering if the yellow will work yeah I think the yellow will work so I'm just gonna pop that there okay and that's the rest of February um, the 1st of March is actually autumn here in Australia so I'm wondering if I can I might just use this to cover Ash Wednesday and write it's autumn if I have some scissors so I'm actually going to um, line this up with this box here because obviously that's going to be the size of the the square so let's see if this works a little bit shorter And then I might just get a piece of deco, one that looks a bit more autumn. Maybe this one. And I'll just pop it here like that. There we go. Then moving along on Friday is my grandmother's birthday. Um, she doesn't live in Australia, so I might just get one of these flags just to remember to send her a message, give her a call um there and then let me see if i can find another birthday icon i think i've used a lot of them up um actually i might use the telephone so i'll use the telephone and then from her icons i'll grab the present we'll get this color and then Oh no, that I want to give her a call like that. And then also on Friday, Pavel's brother and wife and two children go back to Korea because that's where they live, but they're moving back here very soon. So I might just get another label. I'm gonna run out of them though. Um, maybe I'll just use an aeroplane and another flag. Where did it go? Oh my gosh, right here. <laughs> Let's do that. I might put it on this side. Like that. There we go. Now every Saturday we have new releases. So I'm gonna pop a label down on every week. So I'm just gonna alternate the colors, I think. And I brought out my Clever Girl Crafts hearts and I'm going to alternate, I'm going to put them on the new releases and I'm going to alternate the heart colour from this one and this mint. There we go, and then also on the 25th our mystery kit comes out, so I'm just going to grab one of, um, I think, this coloured flag to mark that. So I might put it like this. And I might use that teeny little package icon just here, like that. Okay, then on the 5th, my mum and I have booked in to do a, um, a 
craft class we're doing um, like how to make those polymer clay necklaces which should be really fun so I'm gonna grab another label I think for that I'll just use this peach one and I pulled out this sheet from the coffee monsters co which is kind of like an art and crafts sheet and I might take um, this guy here with the scissors and pop him down so I'm just gonna put this here And this size I think I'll take. There we go. That's really cute. And then also on this day, my nephew is 13 months and I always like to mark it. So I might just get uh, one, maybe that present. Yeah, I'll take this present and mark that. Like that. Then on the 7th I have a doctor's appointment, so I'll grab another label, oh dear, I'm going to run out, that's okay, we'll figure it out, and pop it here, and does she have doctors? She doesn't have doctors, but I'm just going to use this exclamation mark from Planning World because it matches really nicely. So I'm going to pop that here for a doctor's appointment. On the 8th, my dad flies out back to Malaysia. So I'm just going to grab again a little um, flag and aeroplane. Well, they're the same color. Let's use the blue aeroplane. i just put that like this. There we go. Put that there and then I'll write there. Um, then there's nothing else that week yet. On the 14th, actually I want to kind of cover this up I think because we don't have um, daylight savings. So what I might do is maybe use a little bit of washi I'll use this one like that there we go um I'm getting my hair done on the 14th so let's grab a label uh, this one and just because we're on the gold foil bandwagon let's use some more gold foil now where does she have hair I think it's on her older ones I think I'll have to use either this color or I think I'll go with that color or by that silver okay let's just use this color the purple one yeah that's the 14th uh, St. Patrick's Day I don't know if I want to cover that and then write over it um, I'll leave that for a bit on the 22nd, my mum flies out. My parents are off to Europe for a holiday, which I'm very jealous about. So I'm just gonna put this here, get another aeroplane for mum flying out. And then I think that's nearly it. So 28th and then 28th again, I need to change my contact lenses again now that we've got two months in here. So I'm gonna grab this contact lens and I might try and cover up that moon. There we go. Now, I think that's probably it. All I have to start off with. Um, I obviously, I fill things out a lot as the month progresses. So I don't think there's much more. What I might do now is just go ahead and let's put a little bit of deco in. So actually to cover St. Patrick's Day, I'll just use a little bit of deco.
Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and write everything in and I'll be back. Okay, and that is the finished product. I really like it. It's really kind of soft and elegant and um, the gold foil obviously just brings a really nice touch to it. So of course I had to add it more into this, I had to add more of it into the spread with more stickers, but yeah, I think it's worked out really nicely. Um, let me know if you guys would like to see a Rewind February um, monthly kit plan with me. And until my next video, I'll talk to you guys then. Bye.